back once again to howtocookgreatfood.com. If you haven't already, please click that button and subscribe to our channel. Also, please do click that bell icon just below. Really easy. We're making a chili con carne, but we're going to be using ground chicken instead of lamb or beef or whatever you normally use. Stick it in potatoes. Stick it on rice. Stick it in some tortillas. It's really, really delicious either way. Bit of cheese on it, bit of sour cream. Easy, easy peasy. I mean, really simple. It's delicious. Let's go and do it. Let's take a look at some of these ingredients we're going to be using. So, I've got some minced or ground chicken there. You could be using small cut breast chicken if you wanted. Some chopped carrots, nice and small. One can or tin of a red bean. Again, you could be changing that to a different bean. Some onion, cut nice and small. Bit of celery, bit of bell pepper, some chopped garlic, and then equal parts here of cumin powder, paprika. I'm using a smoked paprika, if you can get that, really delicious. And there's some oregano. We're gonna start this off with a touch of oil, salt and pepper, and we're also gonna be using one can or tin of tomatoes, super easy. Okay, so I've got a, a wok, a pan, a skillet, whatever you wanna call it. I've got some oil in there. I'm using an olive oil. You could be using a different oil if you wanted. Okay, so easy this one. So we're gonna start off by dropping in those onions. I just like to cook every, uh, cut everything really nice and small. You don't have to, of course. Some chopped fresh garlic, and that goes. Now, while we're here, we're going to get that celery in. I mean, the celery is optional, but it does give it a lovely flavour, I think. Those carrots. Again, nice and small. And we're on a kind of above medium heat. We're then going to add our ground or minced chicken in there. Of course, you could be using a different meat if you wanted. Pork, lamb, beef, up to you. And maybe four minutes on this heat, stirring it around. Let's get this on its way. So as you can see, our chicken has changed to that familiar white color. Those vegetables are working their magic in there. Simply, we're now going to go in with our beans. Like I say, if you wanted to use something different, a white bean, black eyed peas, chickpeas, they all kind of work. I'm going to add in that little bit of bell pepper. Just using green today, you could be using other colours of course. Now, this is a chilli, and I didn't talk to you about chilli. That's because there's a few options. I'm going to go with some fresh chilli. You could be putting some chilli powder, or you could be putting in a little bit of habanero sauce, like a Tabasco or a hot pepper sauce. So as you can see, I'm going for fresh chilli and a pepper sauce. But yeah, if you want, use all three if you want it. You could add those two and chili powder. Or just go for whatever you have or you fancy. Okay, we're pretty much done. One can or tin of tomatoes. Uh, they were plum tomatoes. I just roughly chopped them with my knife. We're now going to go with our equal parts here, oregano, the paprika and the cumin powder. In they go. Let's get some salt in the mix. And then it's going to be a, hit it with a bit of black pepper. Okay, let's give this a mix. Then what we're gonna do, we're gonna get the heat down, lower the heat down to, not a simmer, just above a simmer, 
pop a lid on this and all you've got to do now is let that go for about eight to ten minutes and you're gonna be done give it a stir every now and then see you in eight nine ten minutes okay off goes the heat check that out really really simple check it for salt now you might want to add a bit more salt that's great for me one sec optional but I find pretty essential gonna get some lovely fresh cilantro or coriander in there get that little mix in and we're done hope you enjoy that stick that on some rice get it in a jacket potato a bit of sour cream on it maybe or cheddar up to you get it in some tortillas it's all good very simple don't forget to subscribe to our channel please do click that bell icon below and we'll see you soon